All right, I've been making videos about Spotify and DJing for a while now, and it finally happened. Spotify has released its own AI DJ. So I've been refreshing my iPad. I've been checking for updates, and it is only rolling out in certain areas, and certain people will get it at certain time depending on where your geolocation is. And today is the day that I got mine, so I'm going to show you guys all about it. This is awesome. So, let's go over to Spotify. And here we are. So, when you go to Spotify, in order to find this AI DJ mode, what you're going to do is you're going to go to, to music. And then here it is. This is it. It says, good afternoon. And it's blue. And it says, a, a mix of current go-tos, old favorites, and some new discoveries you haven't heard yet so what it is it it's more of like an ai assistant or an ai that helps you pick songs for you but let me get one thing clear in the beginning it is not like dj pro ai's auto mix where it's going to beat match and do transitions between the songs that is not what this app does it's that's what i thought it was when i first heard about it but no, that's not what it does. It's a little bit different. It's more like having an AI assistant. So let's let's click on it and see what it does. So all you have to do is press on the blue. Let's try something else. I got some music you were playing a lot a few months back. Up first, the wilder. So there you go. It picks songs that you've been playing for a while. This one's kind of funny because I like to listen to ocean sounds while I sleep. So this is the one that it suggested to me. So as you saw it, it just gave you a little feedback about what the song, about why it's playing the song. For in this example, he said it's because I played it a while back. And it has kind of cool hip voice and it seems pretty fun. Let's see what else happens. So if we go down here and press the symbol for it. All right, I'm going to switch to a few songs you'll be keeping on repeat. So there you go. It's more of like an uh, AI MC than it is an AI DJ. So my subscribers who uh, are DJs, whether they're professional DJs or hobbyist DJs, just know that this is more like an MC than it is a auto mix. I was excited for it to be an auto mix, just like DJ Pro AI within the Spotify app or even being able to mix within the app. But that's not what you can do, and it's a little bit disappointing. Let's see what happens if we play around with it a little bit more. Is it? So we... Boom. So every couple of skips, it seems to hop on and then say something about what it's going to play next. Let's see what it says here. Next, I got some music people were listening to back in your younger days. Maybe you and your friends were into some of this stuff. It was kind of like the background hum of the era. Craig Morgan up first. So there you go. Uh, as you can tell, my Spotify is really, really diverse from country to music that I like to listen to when I sleep and then with the music that I actually like. So right now, it's not really doing anything except just saying something and then playing a song. So keep that in mind. Uh, let's try to get it to say something else. One skip, two skips, three skips, four skips, five skips. Coming up now, I got Netflix, a few other artists in that song. All right, yeah, so it seems like it's every five skips that it'll say something, or maybe if you let the songs play through, it'll be every five songs. So let's see if I skip it five more times, see if he comes and says something else. One, two, three, four, five. There we go. Right now we're going to spend some time with an artist you've been coming back to a lot. It's Pazanji. So there you go. I think it's every five songs he says something and then just plays a track. So it's it, it it's just not DJing. So I'm a little bit upset about that. I'm a little bit, I feel like it's misleading because it's not DJing. They should have just called it AIMC because that is what it's doing. It just MCs 
and then set, says something kind of cool, and then we'll play a couple of tracks. So basically, it's just going through your Spotify history, and then it is going to see what you played in the past, what you played a lot of, what you what you listened to over and over again, and then it's going to say something about it, and then it's just going to play something. There's no jog wheels, there's no effects, there's no loops, there's no nothing to do with DJing at all. So... I'm sorry. I'm pretty disappointed. Again, it is only in beta, and hopefully down the road they improve it a little bit more. I don't know how hard it is for them to do transitions like they do in DJ Pro AI by using Echo and using the EQ and all of these different transitions that it could do because the technology is out there. There are a lot of other uh, auto mixes and DJs, and I really think that Spotify was kind of just... They just called it D. Uh, AI DJ kind of to hop on the DJ hype and they know that everyone's upset that they can't use Spotify in their DJ software anymore and then people just heard DJ and Spotify and got really excited and I am the biggest fan of DJing with Spotify and that's what my channel is basically about and this really disappointed me and let's try to see if it says anything else, let's see if it repeats what it says, or if it's just on a loop, or if it's actually deciding using artificial intelligence. One, two, three, four, five. Up next, it's time for a vibe, and that vibe is Dark Side, starting with Goblins from Mars. Okay, so it seems like it's actually analyzing the songs and what it's about and then what it says about it has something to do with the song so that's pretty cool uh let me just try to get one more uh have an mc for us one more time and see what happens next one two three four five next up i'm going to play you some americana these are the songs our music editors are paying attention to right now song with charlie crockett so that's pretty cool um, let's see what else we could do with this. There is this button down here, the symbol. I'm on it. Coming up now, I got some. So instead of waiting for the five songs or skipping ahead five songs, you could just press the button down here if you want to be contacted by the AI DJ. You just press down here. I got a few songs from one of your top artists from the past. This is Method Man. Okay. So there we go. Uh, let's see if we could access it any other way. If we go to home, and then we could see our playlist that we use, and then over here to the right, it you have the DJ one. So let's see what these three dots do. Yeah. So that's how you get back. So you could go to your normal playlist, like uh, this one, Jimmy Cliff. You could listen to that, and then you could either select it. It, it counts as a, like a playlist in the app, and then it'll start doing that for you. And then also what you could do is you could press it down here okay, if you want to hear from it. So to recap, it's not DJing, it's MCing, and it's just an AI voice saying some stuff to you before it plays a playlist. So overall, I'm disappointed. I do think it's pretty cool, but overall, I think it's disappointing. So if you want to learn more about actual DJing, DJing on the iPad, DJing with DJ Pro AI, subscribe to my channel and give this video a like. Thank you.